Hello everybody, welcome back to Hard Reset Info channel. In today's video, I'll show you how you can easily set up Google Drive, Google Photos and OneDrive on your Samsung Galaxy A36. So first, what you guys need to do is sign in to your Google account. So how we do that is we go to settings and now we need to scroll down until we see accounts and the backup. Now it's right here and after we click it, here we need to go to manage accounts and here click on add account, click on Google and proceed by giving them your email and a password to log in. Now my accounts are all here for Google, Microsoft, OneDrive and Samsung. And now what we need to enable is go back here and make sure that you enable auto sync data. Now go to Google Drive in the same section and now click it. And as you guys can see, the backup is enabled, but there's no data backed up. So we need to click backup now. And now it's backing up our data. It's very important, so don't forget about it. Now, after this, what we need to do is set up Google Drive. So how we need to do that is go to the app. Now here we need to sign in with our account, but we did it before. And if you didn't, you need to sign in now. Here we need to click the big plus icon and click on upload. Here, as you guys can see, we can upload the screenshots from Media Picker Gallery. We can also upload files or something from OneDrive. Now I'm going to choose screenshot. And as you guys can see, now it's being uploaded to the drive. Now here we can choose files to backup, but they are backed up now. After the backup here, the Google Drive ends. So no need to worry about it. But what we need to do now is go to Google Photos to set it up. Here what we need to do is tap on our profile picture in the corner and now go to Backup and Sync which is right here. Click on Turn on Backup, click Turn on Backup and as you guys can see the backup is now complete. And what we can do is go to Photo Settings now here, back up, and now we are sure that everything is backed up. And here, also what we can change is the preferences. We can here manage everything. Or what we can simply do is go back to backup. And here we can change the backup quality, like storage saver or original, depending on our preference. Here we can also include folders and we can also back up using mobile data, but I do not recommend this one. Now, that's it for those two applications. Now, we go to OneDrive, so open it up. Here you need to sign in to your Samsung account and Microsoft account. And after you do that, what you need to do is tap on the profile picture and now open settings. Here, what we need to do is go to OneDrive and link it with the gallery. So how we do that is here we need to scroll down and here we have import cloud photos and files. Now click it and here click connect account to import and you can connect to Google Drive and Google Photos and we will do just that. Here you need to select account Now scroll down and click continue and if needed click continue again. Now as you guys can see around 1GB will be imported to your OneDrive. Now you can import it now or later depending on your preference. I'm going to do that later. And here you can connect the account to import and now choose Google Photos. Here it will be the same process as for the OneDrive. So now select account. Let me do this again.
Now select the account and here click continue and now click continue once again. Now as you guys can see here you can import it now or later. I'm going to do later. And now what we need to do is link OneDrive with the Samsung Gallery. So how we do that is we open the gallery. Now click on this little cloud here. And now click continue. Here what we need to do is log in to Microsoft. So let me do just that. Now after we do that, here as you guys can see we have connecting accounts. Now click on accept. And here you need to log in once again. And now as you guys can see after you log in instantly after entering your password and click login, here this will pop up on your screen which means the gallery sync has started and now everything will be synced with OneDrive automatically. And as you guys can see, now here we can check the backup that there is a check mark inside of the cloud. Now we can also try and take a picture with our camera and let me adjust that, as you guys can see now, the photo should be backed up any second on our OneDrive. If not here, we can also check for Google Photos, and as you guys can see, it's already backed up in here. And that would be it, that's how you can easily set it up. Thank you guys for watching, make sure to leave a like, subscribe and see you in the next video. Bye.